Get ready for the next battle. Welcome to another episode of Wumper Relics, where I, Toonie SA, try to take on Wumper Lewis's Platinum Relic times. Today, we are looking to tackle his time in Hog Wild. Um, and if we have time left over as well, we will do Native Fortress. His time in Hog Wild is 42 44. Hog Wild is one of the levels that I have got a Platinum Relic in before, so I don't anticipate having too much trouble in this level. Um, so yep, yeah, let's go inside. You'll notice that I've changed Crash's skin just to be a little bit more appropriate to vehicle levels. The skeleton outfit didn't quite seem appropriate. So yeah, I'm sure my Platinum Relic time from the past was already faster than Lewis's, but because I don't remember what it was, I thought it best to uh, just do it again. It's a good jump. Oh, that was tight. Getting a wave a little bit here. If only the Rolling Stones donuts were as kind to me as these tribal guys are. I'm getting just as close. It's a good time so far. Swing to the far right, never forget that. There we go. 4094. That is enough to beat Lucy's time. Wow, on attempt one as well. I was kind of expecting, to be honest, to be able to do this one in just a couple of attempts. Or it still feels good anyway. I'm also changing my name from the uh, the uh, bad name to Z N Y. The Z kind of looks like a two, so I can make it simulate Toony abbreviated. All right, so yeah, I'm happy with that one attempt. Because we did Hogwild so quickly, it means that I do have time to do Native Fortress. Lewis has a time, if I just check, of two o one. 25. And as you can see here, the platinum time is 205.80. There's my time with the star all the way back there. That's the best time I've ever got on this level, 224.80. That is a mountain to climb, and I'm completely expecting this level to take me longer than Rolling Stones, which, if I recall correctly, was about 61 attempts. So yeah, let's jump into it. That was a <laughs> not a great start. The jacket and sunglasses don't quite fit this aesthetic. No time to go shopping though today. We've got relics to get. Wumper asses to beat. A good Dwayne the Rock Johnson line. I'm gonna whip your Wumper ass. The only practice I've had on this level within the past two years is literally this morning where I had to clear the level uh, once just so that I could attempt the relic. tribal guy that was giving uh, Wumper Lewis a lot of trouble in his video. Probably my favourite clip from uh, his show so far was uh, him having issues. A private duel, if you will, with that tribal guy every single time he reached him. And while I'm on the topic, I should also congratulate him on a incredible generator room time. It will be a really difficult one to beat. So those spinning wheel parts are definitely the part where I'm most nervous that I'm going to lose time. I was terrible at those as a kid and I'm still pretty terrible at them now.
It's going well so far. I don't think this is on pace for a platinum. It's like, as soon as you say the words, it's going well so far, of course you're going to hit a mask. Well, not a mask, rather, you're going to hit a giant phallic spike. Right. Yeah, looking at the time, that was looking like a gold, maybe, yeah, gold sort of time, so not the end of the world. Let's try attempt number two. Convinced that you can't get past that giant spiky object there. I think it's just the way the cycle works. Oh. Alright. Okay. Yeah, if I drop down the wall sections, there's a high chance that I'm going to restart the level. Purely because I don't like doing them over and over again. It's not like you learn anything new from the level by reclimbing those walls. Wait for it to go down. Oh, fuck off. So I remember getting the gold relic on this level. It took me maybe about an hour and a half to do. Uh, mainly because I kept dying. Not that I was not getting the time, it was just death. Usually on this layer here, the first and third layers, I don't really have too much of a problem of. It's more this layer. That guy can give me problems, the fire can give me problems, oh, just like then. Trying to just shave off those like split seconds. What was that? Like, what happened there? I've never seen it happen before where like, you jump on the prey and just go straight over it. That's a unique death. That was tidy. Oh wow! Did I just make that cycle? Okay. That changes things up a bit. Turns out I'm wrong, you can actually make that cycle, and if you do, you can even make the flame at the top there. Okay. That's, uh, good to know. I'm not entirely sure what I did differently to achieve that, but... I've got to bear it in mind if I'm, like, a second off Lewis's time. safe, don't want another case of sliding straight off it like last time. No thank you. Oh! Oh, okay. Yeah, that's not good. Yeah, see that one second there probably messed up that cycle. That was looking like a good time up until that point. So this isn't going to be the one. Nope. Definitely not going to be the one now. Okay. A good indicator I have is, I think I recall on the... Can we... Can we get the mask, please? That's the thing. 
You just want to keep on running. That's unfair. Alright, we'll take the mask loss. It's not like we need the mask anyway, really. Like, if you can take damage like that to save a little bit of time, it's probably fine. It's not like you can get triple Aku in this level to really change things too much. Okay, that was smooth. Okay, that was not smooth. That lost me about a second. It's definitely an improvement on my previous one anyway. Oh wait, did I beat him? 2 minutes 62? No way. Did I beat him that quickly? 201.25. Yeah, I did. Oh no, okay. I honestly thought that was going to take twice as long as Rolling Stones. When I was getting the gold relic, I mean, you saw my gold relic time. It was really, really bad. And that was like two years ago. Wow, okay. I'm going to... It must be because I'm getting better at the game from Doom Platinum, so I don't know. I'll tell myself that. Okay, we might as well do uh, Up the Creek then as well, because I was not anticipating to beat it that quickly. So the time for Wumpa Lewis on Up the Creek is 1 minute 14.84. I'm still in absolute shock at what I just witnessed with Native Fortress, but I can't even concentrate on this level. I had it like bookmarked in my mind. All right, this is gonna be. I, I said to, uh, I said to my uh, partner, like, this is gonna be an hour and a half, two hours of me not being able to talk for a bit. That was lucky. Okay. Cool. Pop, 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 pop. If I get three done today, that'll be spectacular. Especially after Wumpa Lewis's great run on Generator Room that I saw earlier today. That's gonna be a relic and a half to get through. That's that's a relic and a half. Just putting it. I may or may not take days to get the platinum, let alone his time. I do like the uh, level though, Generator Room. Is, uh, it is a fun level. This level's okay. I know this is one of the ones that uh, he says that he likes quite a bit. This chill. I don't find it like super fun though. Whoa, 114.12. Have I beat him? Yes, I have. Wow, okay. I beat him on three levels today. Okay, I was not anticipating. I was not anticipating this at all, especially first attempt of Up the Creek. I was not even really paying attention to what I was doing. I was still like on the high of just beating Native Fortress. Right, um, yeah, okay. Well, this is going to take me a bit of time to edit anyway, so this will be the final one for the episode. Because the next uh, level is Lost City, and that's another level that I'm really quite poor at. So I anticipate that one will take me quite a bit more time. It is nice to have the change in feel though from uh, yesterday's session on Rolling Stones which was quite a ball lake to get through um, to just having a complete breeze on those three levels. So thank you everyone for tuning in and I'll see you on the next one. I'm not even mad, you know why? 
because I've done this in my mind. It's only a matter of time. I didn't remember actually which direction am I going? Right. That's that. Has to be. Yeah, because if that I did it, bitches. 201 by one second. Oh my god, I actually fucking did it. So, Sapphire is 255, gold is 225, platinum. Oh, it was 205. So, I actually have more seconds than I thought. Well, I said I was only going to be playing for an hour in each video, but obviously, when I get started with something, I really don't want to finish it. So, that's probably not going to be true. This took about two hours, this one. Um, I got that done in like, what, five attempts? This one took about an hour and a half, two hours. You have time to wait for things, right? I'm like, if I see something like a trap that's about to go off or whatnot, I don't wait, I just go. And I, I even know in my head, like, yeah, that's gonna hit me. But I still do it anyway, because the idea is I, I can't waste any time. I know that I just thought that I being impaired. I feel like I can get that though.
Done it. Easy. What's that? 35 gamer score? I'll take it. Earn 10 relics, gold or better. Why have only 0.81% of people done that? Right, next. Right, but we go again. Clean. I'm jumping really early. Is it nearly done? It's just I feel like I'm doing good and I just want it to end. 47, is that good? Second try! Second try! We got the plat on the second try. Nice, what's that? Earn five relics. And they're all platinum, might I add?